Welcome to our insightful tech discussion. Today, we're addressing a question that many newcomers to identity and access management often ponder. Our viewer is curious about the differences between Active Directory and identity and access management tools. They come from a Microsoft background and are trying to understand how these systems interact, especially when it comes to user management and integration. Let's break down their questions and explore the nuances of these essential technologies. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through your question, going through some of the answers and hopefully finding that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy and work through to that resolution. Now, let's get started. Let's begin by understanding the core difference between Active Directory and Identity and Access Management, or IAM. Active Directory is primarily a directory service that manages users and computers within a network. On the other hand, IAM encompasses a broader range of functionalities, including user provisioning, single sign-on, and access governance. It helps organizations manage user identities and control access to resources across various systems. Now regarding integration, yes, IAM tools can be integrated with Active Directory. This allows organizations to leverage existing user data in Active Directory, while enhancing security and access management capabilities through IAM solutions. It's important to note that IAM is not limited to internal users stored in Active Directory. IAM can manage identities across various platforms, including cloud services and third-party applications. Finally, while Active Directory serves as a repository for user credentials, IAM tools can utilize this data to enforce policies and manage access. This means IAM can enhance the functionality of Active Directory by providing additional layers of security and compliance. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. Active Directory and Identity and Access Management, or IAM, often confuse users due to the inconsistent use of the term identity. In IAM, identity is a single identifier linked to multiple accounts across systems. Typically, the authoritative source for this identity is the HR system, not Active Directory. Your primary AD credentials help access resources, but many users have multiple AD accounts. The term identity is often misused, especially in Microsoft discussions. They refer to multiple identities when they should mean accounts. In IAM, we need a single source reference, like a master key linking all accounts. In summary, a consistent definition of identity is crucial for effective IAM, ensuring all accounts are properly linked to a single, unchanging reference. I hope that video helped find the resolution you're looking for. If it did, guys, I'd appreciate it if you could hit subscribe. Until the next time that you need more technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.